I think it's incredibly important that our community, all students, not only have options, but then know what those options are. And as a district, we have proven that we do value that idea. That kids may want or need something different than a traditional school day. So Me Learning Options is a collection of non-traditional programs that serve students that live within the Mead School District boundaries and students outside of our Mead School District boundaries. Me Learning Options is made up of seven different programs. We have Five Mile Prairie, North Star, Mead Outdoor School, and Mead Virtual Program. The reason that there are seven is the models within some of those programs changes as students go from elementary to, to middle and high school. Five Mile Prairie is a homeschool model program, which is K-5. Students attend school one day a week up at Five Mile Prairie. And then the 6 through 12 program is housed down at the Pittsburgh Learning Center, and students attend school twice a week on campus. North Star is a K-12 program that's housed at the Pittsburgh Learning Center, and it's also a homeschool-based program. The Mead Virtual Program is two very different models. The elementary model, which is K-5, there's more synchronous learning that happens where teachers are actually live teaching students for part of their day. And then the secondary model is 6 through 12, and that's 100% asynchronous learning, where students are learning with, without live instruction. Both of those programs are housed at our Mead Virtual Program. The Meet Outdoor School is actually a new program that we piloted last year. It's currently for students in grades first through eighth. That's kind of a hybrid model where students are on campus twice a week and they're really getting their social studies and science curriculum met through certificated teaching when they're on site. And then the rest of their program is done at, at home. The only other program that I haven't mentioned is our Aspire program and it's a lot of our students that, for whatever reason, the traditional high school setting doesn't work for them, whether they don't want to be in a setting where there's that many students, or they might be deficient in credits and need some support getting back up, getting back on track. Those students may come to us for a small chunk of time, it might be a month, but they might also come to us as a seventh grader and then stay with us through graduation. Why it's important, I think, that we have not only the flexibility of creating a different option if our community needs that, it's also important that within those different models, we say, who's the educator? Who's teaching our students in this model? What we've realized is we have families that want the family unit. Somebody at home is providing the instruction, so we say they're the primary educator. And then we have programs where almost 100% of the instruction is being delivered by a certificated teacher that's hired by the Mead School District. And then you have everything in between. One of the best things that we can really experience as an educator is a student finding success, whatever that looks like. And that looks so many different ways for the individual student. What we've found is that maybe a student who hasn't found that success in the traditional setting, they do find success in our program. And that doesn't happen by accident, and it's not just because of the model, um, it's because the, the staff that work in these programs are truly dedicated to student success. What I'm really excited about for the future of these programs is it's really whatever we want to make it. As a school district, where we see these programs fit, there is no ceiling to that. There is no cap on what you can and can't offer. As long as we're connected to our community and as long as we are trying to hear what our community says they need, we can be as creative as we want. And that's really exciting. If we can dream it, I think we can create it.